to strengthen Nigeria's security environment and architecture, there's an absolute necessity for massive recruitment of at least 1.5 million people into the Nigerian police force. According to the Young Progressives Party presidential aspirant and former deputy governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, Dr. Kingsley Mogalu, this will be his administration's first priority if voted into office. He told Channel Television's Ladia Akiri Dulale on our special political program, Roadmap 2019, that without police reforms, things will not change for the better. We don't have a police force in this country. I make bold to tell you that. It is a joke. You have 200 million people, you have 300,000 police, one third of who are guarding VIPs in their homes. Meanwhile, the country is facing serious challenges of security. That is number one. So the police force is grossly inadequate, assuming it were even to be capable. But on top of that, we know they're not properly trained, we know they're not properly equipped, and we know they're not properly motivated, which is why waiting you carry. So the question of even the remuneration of the police force is an issue. If they're just as poor as anybody else, then they will use their authority to extort in order to survive. So I believe, and I will, recruit 1.5 million new policemen, recruit them, train them, so that this country can be properly co co policed in the communities and in various other parts of the country. And hopefully, when we restructure the country, they'll devolve down to various regions, and there'll be a federal structure somewhere there. Do you see what I'm saying? But I police do. reform is job number one.